I think for preparation of any type of competitive examination, it is very important to strengthen your foundation, your base in science. And so I did uh, in 9th and 10th, I joined Akash Foundation courses to strengthen up the topics that are already being taught in the NEET syllabus. Hi friends, I am Argadeep Datta. I am connected with Akash Central Kolkata branch for the past 4 years. I pursued my foundation course in class 9th and 10th in online mode and I secured 96.57% in my class 10th course examination of West Bengal Board of Secondary Education. And I joined the classroom courses for 2 years integrated NEET UG 2024 in 2022 in the Park Circus branch of uh, Akash Institute. I decided to become a doctor and join the NEET preparation mainly due to two reasons. Uh, the first one is after the class 10 boards, our school to a seminar in the Institute of Neuroscience Kolkata where we came in touch with uh, several neurosurgeons who are pursuing research along with their practicing in medicine field. And the second reason that is very important that there is no one in my family who is a doctor. My sister is an engineer also and so my parents wanted me to become doctor and serve the people. So my goal is to pursue my MBBS from AIMS Delhi as this institute as we all know provides the best possible environment for research as well as every field in medicine, practicing and surgery. I was recommended to join Akash classroom programs by most of our seniors who are already pursuing their MBBS courses uh, from different government medical colleges as well as AIMS all over the uh, India and most recently I got to know about the infrastructure that Akash provides for the improvement in uh, need preparation in terms of tests, the faculties, everything are top notch and best for need UG preparation. I am extremely satisfied. I think for preparation of any type of competitive examination, it is very important to strengthen your foundation, your base in science. And so I did uh, in 9th and 10th, I joined Akash Foundation courses to strengthen up the topics that are already being taught in the NEET syllabus uh, or J syllabus that was not actually predetermined at the time. Uh, but then from the first day of the classroom program when I joined Akash, I uh, listened to or attended each and every lecture very carefully, make the notes itself in the class. I didn't use to make separate copies for fair notes or rough notes or something like that. I think that's a piece of time waste, I, I think. But in our Saturdays, the classes were extended to 8.30. Then after coming back to home, uh, I usually used to read everything that was actually being written in the notes. Because I think it was necessary uh, to make a sample image of the topic that has already been uh, studied during whole the day. And in the next day, the Sunday, uh, I used to take all the classes. And ultimately, after these weekends, actually sum up everything that has already been taught in these two days and I then started to solve the questions from the module. The modules were very interesting, very important and conceptualized uh, in terms of theory as well as questions. The, all the questions were based on NCRTs and as it is uh, for physics and chemistry also it is something like which actually comes in need. Uh, so I think the practicing questions regularly along with your lectures is the key uh, for success. And then after a few months when the tests start started, the term test, the fortnightly test, the most important part is to follow the sequence. What actually we are being taught, we are actually being following, the system is to be followed by each and every candidate carefully. Because they set the syllabus in such a way that if you give the test, if you prepare for the test, that part of the syllabus will be done. So giving regular tests, attempting tests are very, very important and it was also important to clear your doubts. Like after each and every test, you should analyze everything, the mistakes you have done, you have to check the NCRTs, which points you have already forgotten. And another strategy for preparation must be that your preparation must be NCRT based in terms of biology, chemistry as well as physics. Because in our paper we could see that there were certain physics questions that were directly put from NCRT statements. So this is very important. The preparation of boards and NEET can be done simultaneously. There is a growing misconception about that board preparation and NEET preparation cannot be done to all together. But it is completely a myth. Uh, like I actually study in West Bengal board, my state board. where. The syllabus is completely NCRT based. There are few additional topics though, but actually in overall terms, in all state boards, they actually cover NCRT up to 90%, 95% actually. So when we study the modules, when we attend the lectures, everything that actually comes in boards are already being covered. So there is no burden that you have to mug up things and every examples and everything. You just need to go through the NCRT only. And what you can do is actually very important to make or separate a timetable because uh, 
except for physics chemistry biology there are some optional subjects there are languages for me it was english bengali and mathematics so in order to manage the time you have to efficiently divide how your ability is amongst these subjects so like bengali and english the language subjects are relatively to a easier extent so they do not require so much uh, time so you can actually manage one day in a week to uh, read this for three to four hours and for mathematics or something like that uh, you can actually choose an easier subject also you can choose an easier subject that can be actually done in two or three months before the exam but if you take mathematics or something like that then you actually have to uh, make a specific time slot uh, a very short time slot even one to two hours each day uh, in order to practice that and what is the most important thing is the compatibility that's if what we actually study here actually comes in board also there is nothing to fear about it we do not have to take any other preparation for boards only another important aspect for uh, the neat aspirants is that to keep up your health uh, health is one of the major contributing factors in the actual day of neat exam uh, and also during the process of learning like in the last month of the test when you were giving a multiple tests of final test season ats and everything there is a huge load on your brain that we all we all face but what is actually necessary is not to stress out everything will be just keep in mind that everything will be sort out if you have already studied two years or one year or anything in uh, consistently and attentively there you cannot do anything in the last month you cannot change anything so what we need to do is to focus on your health we have to we should eat dry food so we should keep our eating habit completely according to the need day like in our case the need exam was like 2:30 2 to 5:20 uh, so i used to avoid eating during this time period like i used to have my lunch during 11:30 and then after 5:30 i used to again uh, take some food this habit actually is necessary i think for the need day for you have to practice it for like 2 weeks or 3 weeks because during the exam if you feel hungry then your brain will not work especially in calculative part we will do calculation mistakes we will not read the questions carefully it's a important part i would prefer to give all the tests all the classes in offline mode only because neat is a offline paper it's a web based paper but on when you are sick and a important topic is being taught like i was uh, once i uh, had a fever during photosynthesis what taught so photosynthesis is a conceptually heavy topic it's actually a bit tougher side i will say so you have to actually attend the class in online mode you can do that but what is actually necessary is by any means Hey, who can cook? You have to clear your doubts, and you have to be confident about that. I can do any questions that actually comes from this topic. All the best. You can do it. Thank you.